Thank you, Jesse. Yeah, I appreciate it so much. Well, you might have noticed that Todd Warren is not here doing the weather tonight, and there is a reason for that. Todd took part in a weather conference nearly two weeks ago, and we learned that someone who attended that conference has tested positive for coronavirus. Todd isn't showing any symptoms, and please know he's doing very well. In fact, he joins us now live from his home. Chief, good evening to you. This is all being done as a precaution. That's true. Just to just be on the safe side, as you mentioned, I'm not feeling any symptoms or anything like that. In fact, today I spent the afternoon actually working on some graphics that I learned about at the conference. So ironically, so uh, again, nobody there that we know of else other than that one person has uh, contracted the coronavirus so far, as far as we know. Now, I know this is a very big concern for you. You've got a brand new grandbaby. Your parents um, live in town here, so you've got to be extra mm -hmm. careful. That's true. Uh, you know, obviously, it would have been better to find out since it's almost two weeks ago. We're almost done with that window, but it would have been nice to find out if sooner. Uh, but uh, the fact that it took so long to find out actually could be a good sign because I'm kind of thinking that that person may have contracted it after the conference was over. Uh, since this, we're talking about the beginning of March, at that time, you know, most of the infections were occurring in, in California and Washington. So it's... Uh, kind of doubtful that uh, that person was infected by, at that time. At the same time though, Todd, you're setting a very good example for everyone mm -hmm. out there. We're telling people to do exactly what you're doing. It You recognized it and you did it. Yeah, just, uh, just, just, be, just be on the safe side because, you know, you never know. Um, even though that's, uh, as I mentioned, that risk is probably uh, somewhat slim, just be on the safe side. But once we get back uh, past uh, Saturday, and I'll be back Monday, uh, no, no doubt about that, as, uh, again, we just got to give it that two weeks just to be on the safe side. And, again, if, if you feel the symptoms, you know, feel a little fever, get a little cough or a little, you know, sniffle, uh, good idea to take it easy and get yourself checked out and just to make sure you don't pass it along because we always hear about that curve we want it to go like this we don't want it to go like that so uh, doing something like this uh, will help prevent that yeah you certainly are being responsible I feel for you though because I'm sure that Christy your wife has a little to-do list for you while you are home <laughs> the man cave looks uh, I think uh, uh, I have an after I, ha I have an afternoon date with the garage tomorrow. Oh. Oh, I'm so looking forward to it. <laughs> All right. Well, we're looking forward to seeing you back here. Thanks, Todd. Yeah, appreciate your time, Todd. More coming up.